Hello guys, welcome to this session. Uh, our topic is soil and we're still discussing about the soil erosion. Uh, so far in our previous videos, we were discussing about the agents of the soil erosion. We said that these agents of soil erosion are just those factors that lead to the soil erosion. We said that there are four main agents of, of soil erosion, namely humans, animals, wind, and running water. Uh, so far in mostly uh the last previous video we were discussing about the running water uh we said this water is just one of the major agents of the soil erosion now we said that the erosion that is caused by water it occurs in four main ways we said namely there is splash erosion sheet erosion real erosion and gal erosion so uh so far we have discussed the two of them the splash erosion and the sheet erosion. So today let's finish up discussing the real erosion and the gal erosion. So this real erosion, this is just a type of erosion that results in just very small yet well-defined streams. It happens when water from the rainfall it does not soak into the soil but runs across it instead. So the reels or just small channels are the ones that are caused when water running across the surface of the ground, ground gathers in a natural depression in the soil and erosion is concentrated as the water flows through that kind of the depression. Now the real erosion is common in bare agricultural land, practically uh, overglazed land whereby the land is very open, there's no vegetation that is covering that land. So the real erosion is likely to occur and it, it also likely to occur in a freshly cultivated soil where the soil structure has been loosened. This means that the, uh, the soil has been tilled up and, make, and made the soil very loose uh, for, uh, for cultivation. So this way, this kind of erosion can occur. So the real erosion is often described uh, as the intermediate stage between the sheet erosion and the gall erosion. Uh, these leaves can be up to maybe 30 centimeter deep. Now, if they become any deeper than 30 centimeter, they are referred to as the gallies. Moving on. So this is how the real erosion looks like. So as you can see, here it's just running water on a bare land that is the land that's left empty. There's no vegetation covered here and due to the rainfall that it has maybe just rained. So this kind of this kind of erosion. So real erosion it looks like this. I hope it's clear about the real erosion. Moving on, uh last not least uh the gall erosion. The gall erosion this is defined as the removal of the topsoil along drainage channels by surface uh, water runoff. So this is the developed kind of real erosion. It is the type of the soil erosion that it consists of an open, incised and unstable channel general more than 30 centimeter deep. Now, these most gullies, they extend upslope as a result of head uh, of the gully being continually undercut and collapsing. Now, however, the collapse and the slumping of the side walls usually contribute a greater proportion of the soil loss. So that's uh, how the gall erosion occurs. It just removes the top soil uh, along all of the drainage channels uh, by this surface uh, line of, of water. So this is the most destructive type of erosion as it involves the removal of the large amounts of soil, both from the top soil and to the subsurface layers. So this is how the gall erosion looks like, and it's very intense and, and since it distracts the, all the topsoil. As you can see here, the topsoil has been removed by this surface runoff of water. Uh, also, and it, it also distracts the subsurface layers of the soil. So it leaves uh, this kind of distraction to the scenario of a land or a place. Now, when too many galleries they form uh, on land, they produce a bad land. So many galleries they form the balance whereby the lands are just so uh, bare and empty. Uh, there are no vegetation covering them and they are really unstructured since they've been distracted or destroyed by uh, intense uh, this runoff of water.
uh, office square guys. Uh, thank you for listening. We've discussed the uh the uh water erosion. We've seen uh all the main uh, types of the erosion caused by water. We finished up the remaining two uh, from our previous video, the gut erosion and the little erosion. Thank you.